Sunday, December the 10th, day 10 of Vlogmas. So I got up bright, and, even though I went to bed late, I was up bright and early, um, but I got a lot done. I had to wind up a bunch of yarn and pack some orders. Um, got my new mitten pattern on Etsy, so that's available. I'll show you that in a minute. Um, yeah, I'm just kind of poking around, getting stuff done. I ate Christmas snack mix for breakfast and I'm hydrating. <laughs> we had a lot of fun. Yep, lots of bubbly, fun presents. Um, the girls love their cards that I did and I was getting messages this morning and some of them are already putting them in picture frames so that made me feel nice. I thought they turned out really pretty too. So um, yeah, we had fun. My gosh, there was blankets and simmer pots and mittens and pajamas and we have a lot, we spoil each other. And uh, like I said, we've done this for a long time. We know each other really well. So it's, we know, we know fun things to buy for each other and uh, we don't get to see each other enough. So we caught up, had a great time. I got home around midnight. I was the first to leave. I was so tired. I hit, hit a wall and uh, just came home and had a good night's sleep. So today, not much is going on. I'm just gonna have a nice quiet day gonna run to the grocery store uh, the kids are coming for supper so if I don't find a dessert that I think looks yummy at Sobeys maybe I'll make some chocolate chip cookies um, what else yeah so this morning I got a new colorway up on my Etsy site too it's, it, I just did another um, mitt kit so they're all sold out but this week I'm gonna I'm gonna pick away at replenishing them so people have been asking but I think this turned out beautiful. So I called this Fireside. So I've just put um, a few mitt kits in my shop. I did the colorway on some DK. It's so pretty. So this week I'm going to get it on my sock base as well. And then I finally got my mitt pattern up too. I've been kind of like picking away at making sure I try to prove proofread how I wrote up the pattern and got some of my friends and my mom too as well so hopefully it's all good but anyway I called this one holidays and it's just a plain mitten I used my I used my DK my MCN DK uh, I did mine in tickled pink and it has this really pretty braid detail so in the pattern, I've shared um, a YouTube tutorial that I really like. It's that Vickle braid. And yeah, they're just a, just a cute, simple pattern. I don't think it's hard. I think, you know, I want to say it's intermediate only because the braid, it's not fussy. You just, you have to pay attention and take your time. It's not quite as simple as my Ready for Snow pattern, but... You can do it. There's YouTube tutorials everywhere. And I would suggest using like a tonal yarn or um, a solid color just so that you can pick up on that detail. You know, when you, after it's knit, you'll see it. You'll see it uh, a little more well with, with um, you know, speckled or colorful yarn. You might not see that. So Anyway, so that's up on my Etsy shop right now. If you have any questions, please ask. But I'm having fun just uh, just putting together these little ideas for people. And um, I've been really loving uh, knitting mitts this season. So I did that. So yeah, the new colorways in the shop. A favorite thing I wanna share with you is, um, I hope most of you have Spotify. 
when I was at that Etsy market a few weeks ago, uh, Kate Hunter, who assembled this awesome event, had reached out to all the vendors just asking for, you know, your favorite Christmas songs, and she was going to uh, put together a playlist for the day. She put together a playlist, and it's over six hours long. She popped it on Spotify so we can all have access to it. It's awesome. So it's called, it's called the Holly Jolly Playlist, Volume 3, and oh, it's seven hours, seven hours of music. Oops. And I'm starting to play it. There's the image if you're looking for it, if you want to download it, if you're having a party or a get together, want really nice music that plays for seven hours. <laughs> I played it the other night and the girls were loving it, or last night and the girls loved it. So uh, a couple of them downloaded it. So I thought I'd share that with you. So if you wanted a good, easy Christmas playlist, go on Spotify and download that because it's a, it's a good one. Lots of really happy songs. And I will open day 10 of my advent. Today it's called Strawberry Brioche Donut. Yum. Try not to make too much noise. Ooh, pretty. Very pretty. Of course, I love this. It's a really like bubble gummy pink. Very sweet. Some little speckles. So yeah, I'm tired. I, I didn't, I got, I slept well, but not long enough. So I'm just gonna go get these errands done. Uh, the kids are coming for supper. We're gonna barbecue pork chops. Uh, I'm gonna make a mac and cheese recipe in the Instant Pot. Um, I found one online this morning. I usually follow a few different recipes, but this one is called the Salty Marshmallow. So I'm gonna try this Instant Pot mac and cheese recipe. It's, it sounds pretty easy. And uh, I'll, I'll put the details on the screen of where you can find the recipe and uh, I'll maybe put on the screen later after we have supper, if it was, uh, <laughs> if it's a two thumbs up. If it's a two thumbs up recipe, I'll say so. Can't really mess up mac and cheese. And that's my day. So it's gonna be a quiet one, a short vlog today because I just wanna chill as much as I can. We, um, I have a busy week. We, I've got a lot of dying to do. A holiday party Tuesday night, my family Christmas party Friday night. So I get to enjoy today where I truly have nothing to do but eat and knit hang out with my kids later, and that's that. So I will see you guys in a bit. Okay, bye. Do you wanna go for a walk? You ready for a walk? Yeah.